This is Carolina AM. Welcome back to Carolina AM. I tell you what, Christmas time is coming. And uh, the one reason that I know that is that we are here on location at St. Nick Next with Karen Wilson. And Karen Wilson, I would say, has been the, oh my, there's so much magic <laughs> has been created in this place. Yes. Because of your vision over so many years, and none of that's changed. First of all, welcome to the show. Thank Glad you. You're here. Thank you for the invitation. You're welcome. Yeah. And thank, thank you for what you, your magic you've done to our set at Fox is absolutely amazing. And a lot of those, the brainchild of all this stuff, all this stuff starts right here. And people are always wondering, how am I gonna decorate my tree this year? What am I gonna do? And there, there are trends that kind of go from year to year. And the, the tree that we're standing in front of, you said, is a trend this year. This has been an incredible trend this year. And I will say that Christmas really ste steps up a little bit ahead of fashion trend. Like when I go to market and I'm looking at ribbon and florals and what's available because I can only create what I can buy mm -hmm. for the shop. So I'm looking for cutting edge. I'm looking for the next best thing along with tradition. And we'll talk about that. Okay. But when you look at trend, you're also looking at what will be fashionable. And the reason I bring that up is because long before Barbie yeah. got to be a big deal. Right. But long before that pink. Pink was a huge hit at market. So it's easy to use pink either as a complete new statement in your home mm -hmm. or you can add pink into your existing colorways. So pink, any colorway of pink, soft pink all the way up to your hot pinks are an incredible addition to Christmas. Okay, I, I, um, I, I, I covered a story a few weeks ago and in this story, most Americans, the, the average Americans and now the, does not have just one tree in their home, Karen. They've got multiple trees. It's because of Callahan's. It's, it's, it's because of Callahan's. So, <laughs> it's because of Callahan's. So this is the best place if you're looking for yeah. ideas for those trees. If you've got a traditional yeah. tree, maybe in your living room, you want to put up something different like this one mm -hmm. in your bedroom or another room, you've got freedom to change the, yes. the motif in yes. a little bit and, and, and go with a different it's, color. Sometimes it's just a reshuffling of what you have purchased in the past take your different colors, move to a different room. It's not as if you are locked into one colorway. Most families will do a, some sort of family. It's your 20 years of tradition or mm -hmm. 30 years of tradition that you wanna do in a family room. But you also wanna do more of a designer tree. And so you're looking at different colorways. And what we hope to present here is every color that you can possibly dream of and put it in combination. Pink, purple, orange, coral, blues, teals, aquas, coppers, you name it, and we have pretty much covered the color wheel to give you some sort of option to be able to use what maybe you already have or to start completely fresh. And, and this one's called the uh, Oriental Tree, is that right? This is the Pink Oriental pink Tree. Oriental tree. Let's, this get, is let's the, get, be this specific. Is, we do, yeah, Pink Oriental, and the reason why, and this really gives us a good opportunity to see what you can do that's maybe a little outside of the box. And that's what trend, you know, you're pushing, you're pushing. So what we've done on this tree is we're able to bring in spring florals. Like this. Like a hydrangea. This right. in, in and of itself is a spring summer floral. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you mix it on a Christmas tree with different colors, red, hot pink, a bright kind of lilac to another shade of pink, adding in some blue with pagoda, um, the blues as well as the chinoiserie, you get an entire feeling of, a, of an oriental tree. Karen, how many people come to St. Nick's? I, mean, I know they come all year long, it's not just Christmas time, but they ask you for you personally say, you know what, I need some help with this. They can give you a piece of whatever they're wanting to decorate the room with, mm -hmm. and then you help craft a tree around that. It can work a lot of different ways. Yes, it can be that way, or they're inspired by what, by what they come in to see here and then they want to take that back home. And so we can do it either way. Most people will choose a floral, mm -hmm. choose a ribbon, choose an ornament style, and then they'll build it out okay. from there, yeah. Well, I'm really excited because the, over the next several weeks, Karen's gonna be on the show every single week showing us something that we can do differently to decorate your home, your office even, during the Christmas mm -hmm. season. We're so glad that you're here to lead oh, us along the way. You. And thanks yeah. again for making Christmas magic in the FXB studios. We'll see you next week from St. Nick's, Nick Nicks. But right now, we'll be right back with more of Carolina AM.